And now the number of fully vaccinated people in Latin America and the Caribbean is now approaching 50% of the regional population. But health officials are warning of uneven distribution. Rafael Romo brings us more. Act locally, act smarter, and act together. That's the message coming from Pan American Health Organization Director Carissa Etienne regarding COVID-19 containment efforts in Latin America. During her weekly press briefing Wednesday, Etienne said that 41% of all residents in the region are now fully vaccinated against coronavirus. The problem, she warned, is that coverage hasn't been evenly distributed. She asked regional leaders to maintain sanitary measures, saying they should still be prioritized. As for hotspots, the director said the situation is more severe in the Caribbean, where two countries, the Dominican Republic and Barbados, have reported increases of over 40% in the number of confirmed cases over the last week. The good news, according to Etienne, is that 4.6 million COVID-19 vaccines from the COVAX initiative will reach Latin America and the Caribbean by the end of the week. And given that many people have spent months indoors and may have lower defenses, Etienne also pointed out that the influenza vaccine is even more important now to prevent infections. She said the Pan American Health Organization and the U.S. Centers for Disease Control are working together to implement a new protocol to detect both the flu and COVID-19 from the same sample.